hey you guys what is up welcome back to the channel family you already know what time it is gang gang we in this thing make sure you hit that subscribe button to be a part of the crew smash that like button to see what it do y'all okay so let's get into this reading for you this is going to be for my gemini's let's see what y'all have popping off for the next 48 hours okay full moon energy going on so let's see what y'all Gemini's is manifesting. Past couple days been a little bit crazy for y'all. So I'm hoping that things is getting better. Hopefully during this full moon, y'all chilling out. You know what I'm saying? All that. All right. But let's see what y'all got going on next 48 hours. Hunty. Okay. Child, we got the sun. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on, Gemini's? Okay. So y'all have the sun card is in reverse. Honestly, with the fifth shock Archangel Gabriel, honestly, y'all are working against the energy right now with the sun card being in reverse. Y'all are working against yourselves. You know what I'm saying? It's like you guys are putting yourself in a situation to where it's like based upon the feelings that you're holding on to for whoever it is that you're looking for appreciation and support from. It, it, it's it's not working out for you it's not working out for y'all gemini's okay because y'all have um the action card which is saying that y'all are going to be taking action y'all going to be making moves towards looking for some sort of appreciation or support from someone that you still have feelings for with this broken heart card and with the financial constraints now's the time to where gemini's might be going through situations to where it's like y'all finances is like might not be looking too good. Y'all might have situations to where y'all might be spending money on this person. Um, It's like you're going to be taking action towards like based upon y'all holding on to feelings for this person. Y'all are going to be spending money on this person. And you could put yourself in a situation to where it's like, I, I don't know, to where you might be compromising your uh your money. You know what I'm saying? Depending depending on how much you trying to get support or appreciation out of this person or it's like y'all are going to be showing them support or appreciate sending them gifts um through social media you know but it's definitely dealing with money so this is definitely like some sort of gifts y'all spending money on this individual and honestly with that sun card you work it against yourself whenever it comes to y'all doing that okay um this person they don't care about y'all gifts they don't move the one they don't want to be with you anymore, Gemini. Y'all did too much. Hold on. Y'all are still caught up. I'm hearing that y'all miss this person's body. Hold on. Let's see. We got the storm warning. This one's in reverse. Here we go. Gemini's victory card y'all about to create a whole new situation based upon y'all being jealous of so this person has moved on to somebody else and y'all are jealous of the fact that this person's moved on to somebody else it's like y'all don't want to give it up with the first chakra archangel michael this one's in reverse saying that y'all about to create a new situation based upon jealousy with the woman holding a coin in the second chakra archangel ariel it's like you want to get close to this person uh, with that second chakra archangel Ariel, you want this person to nurture your thoughts, your feelings, your emotions. Um, with the woman holding a coin, this is somebody that's, um, it could even be, uh, some of y'all Geminis might be lost out over a female. Uh, for my male Geminis, for my female Geminis, this could be you guys being caught up in terms of um, a male that has you emotionally caught up. Um, you might find yourself sitting back spending money on a male, but... Uh, I'm seeing for my male Gemini's, y'all's got caught up. Y'all creating a new situation. Um, y'all are jealous. Y'all and things, things you creating an unstable situation here with this first shock Archangel Michael. Then you got the second shock Archangel Ariel and the storm warning card in reverse. So it's like you try not to be like too over chaotic in terms of you wanting this person to nurture your thoughts and feelings. But it's like it just plays out that way. It's just playing out that way based upon y'all being in jealousy. Y'all caught up in jealousy. And the jealousy is causing you to be unstable. And whoever it is that y'all, um, that broke away from y'all can see your in instability right now. Um, this could also be some um, situations where you might bring somebody new in as well to try and make this person jealous. That could be another thing. All right. And... 
Okay, so with the garden and the gate card, y'all are, there's something that we're going to be observing. Y'all going to be observing. Everybody going to be observing. With this door to personality and happiness in reverse, y'all are unhappy based upon this happy family. So it's like y'all family either got broken up. Um, This could be situations to where um y'all are unhappy whenever it comes to relationship wise. It's like it's difficult for you to get into another relationship. Um, it's difficult for you to get close to someone and, you know, build that type of relationship. And with the adjacent possibilities, it's saying that y'all are looking for opportunities to relieve stress. Y'all are looking for ways to let go of this stress. This could also be situations to where y'all looking for opportunities to try and connect with this individual because with that victory card saying that y'all are creating a new situation. So y'all looking for um, some sort of opportunity to connect with this individual. This could be us observing, especially with Gemini's, y'all sitting back talking about that person, talking about their relationship because you're um, unhappy. And then we got the third chakra archangel, Camille, which is saying that you desire to connect with this person with that door to spirit. So you guys, like, y'all desire to have, like, a deep connection with this individual. And with the healer of the ages in reverse, it's like y'all are y'all are going in reverse. <laughs> y'all are going in reverse with this healer of the ages in reverse. Y'all have some growing to do on a spiritual level. Y'all have to outgrow this connection. Y'all have to outgrow this desire for this person to be in your life. Y'all are lost in someone. I'm hearing I don't care. I don't care about nothing. Um, and that's that door to personal healing and happiness in reverse. Y'all in that energy to where y'all don't care about nothing. And then we have the magician in the mirror. Y'all gonna be making some bad choices based upon love. Okay, so yeah, Magician in the Mirror, this one's in reverse. Y'all gonna be making some bad choices with the woman holding a heart. So based upon this person not giving you attention with the Thinking Man card, this one in reverse is saying that um, whatever it is that y'all are trying to think or trying to do, it's not gonna go as planned. And with that Karen Connection card in reverse and the Angel of Love in reverse, it's saying that this individual doesn't care, they don't love you. This could be situations to where you feel like you're not able to do things. You feel like you're not able to really structure your mind, structure your life because this person doesn't care for you because they're not showing you love. So it causes you to make bad choices whenever it comes to you um, moving on or accepting that things are over. I'm here, man, I'm tired of this shit. I'm tired of going through this. They put me through so much. Why they have to do me like that? That's all y'all got going on, Gemini. All right, hold up. Then we also have the door to value in the fourth chakra, Archangel Raphael. So it's like... This part... Y'all, Gemini, y'all lot with this door to value, it's like... Y'all have some sort of like... Y'all put some sort of value on this person, whether it be in terms of money wise, whether it be in terms of like you just valuing this person a lot. Um, and with that attachment card in reverse, this person detached away from you. That deceit card is in reverse. So it's going to be situations to where this person detaching y'all might be searching or looking for some sort of forgiveness. All right. I'm up. This could be situations as well to where this person detached, their heart chakra is open, and right now they might be valuing other things whenever it comes to love, relationships, what it is that they're doing, their career. Um, and, you know, it's one of those things where y'all might be looking to come back, and I even might be, but y'all are looking to come back, and this person has detached away from you. They've already switched up in terms of what it is that they value in their life. They already made new career moves. They're already making new career moves. They're already, you know going about their life they already uh, moved on into a new situation uh, let's see they're with someone else they're not paying you any mind and this is what y'all are upset about oh boy and we have the listening core and the door to spirit in reverse okay so basically um y'all the type to where y'all not it's like in this Gemini, child, girl, honey, <laughs> what's going on? Y'all not listening to nothing with this one being reversed. Y'all not, 
like when this person is telling you like hey i'm not interested y'all not gemini's y'all not listening to it door to spirit this one's in reverse is somebody that disconnected from you and y'all not listening to what this person has to say y'all not paying attention to their actions y'all don't care um with the belonging court and the moon court and the high priestess of water it's saying that right here this person is comfortable Whenever it comes to their feelings and their emotions, they're comfortable um, with whoever it is that they done moved on to. And with the playful core and the invisible core, it's saying that they're taking their feelings, emotions very seriously. So this is someone that's making sure that you don't create an imbalance whenever it comes to their uh, emotional state. And then also we have the invisible core. So this is somebody that's not even paying attention to you. They're not watching because right here they have some sort of structure in their life. They, you know, it's like they already got it together they done moved on and that's eight cords so that's gonna be a lot of change and transformations that y'all are gonna be dealing with in terms of trying to let go all right so hopefully this helps y'all out does somebody got a baby i'm hearing somebody got a baby or something i don't know or maybe somebody's expecting or they're looking towards building a family with this new person that they're with um, all right. So anyways, comment, like, subscribe. See y'all next video and peace out.